Budapest on four, the moves are coming thick and fast in the Times Speed Chess Challenge. Some days when you come to the uh, you come to the board and uh, you don't see anything at all. And I think today was one of those days for me. My mind was a total blank. I was looking at the chess pieces like I had never seen them before. So <laughs> it was not a very good day for me. Nigel Short speaking there on Tuesday after he just lost the second speed chess game against the world champion Gary Kasparov. Well, good evening for almost the last time from the Savoy Theatre. Game three in the Speed Chess Challenge took place this afternoon. Now, having lost the first two games, Nigel Short desperate for a draw. Otherwise, the chances of a whitewash for Gary Kasparov would be a distinct possibility. Well, with me in the studio are three grandmasters, Raymond Keane, Daniel King and John Spielman. And uh, we'll be talking to uh, these gentlemen a little later in the programme and also to both players. But first, let's just have a quick recap on the rules. These are they. Each player has 20 minutes in which to make all of his moves. If he runs out of time or he's checkmated, he loses. Now, uh, let's go back to the beginning of play today. Kasparov playing white. Well, let's tr play predictor move. I predict 1e4, Daniel. Well, I think d4. I think Kasparov's going to play d4. Any other takers? But, but Ray, Ray, you think e4. Carol says b4. B4. Yeah. And what's the name of that opening? No, it's the orangutan. Oh, that's right. Well, let's see. <laughs> Same thing. Waiting for... <laughs> Knight f3. Oh. oh. We were all wrong. Oh, this is a... This could be a retty opening. So he's just made...